Hey, John. Yeah? We're going to sue AMC. Why? We're stealing an hour and a half of our lives. Couldn't we have just watched Kingsman again? <laughs> Hey, I'm Jonathan. I'm John. And we're here to review the awful Mall Cop 2. So, the plot of this movie is we have Paul Blart, who saved them all on the last Black Friday, and now he goes to Vegas for a vacation, and of course, there's something happening in the hotel he's staying at, and he has to be the hero and save the day. So, what were your expectations going into this movie? I just hope it doesn't hurt too bad. I want to make it out yeah. with my life. And to, the, to our credit, we did make it out. We it didn't kill us. We're here. I mean, you know, I thought the first Small Cop was a pretty funny movie. It was very stupid, very right. silly, but it was pretty entertaining. It was stupid. I mean, it was pretty much just um, lovable fat guy humor, but I thought it, it worked. It was yeah, kind it was of funny. a cute kid for families to watch, and it had some things in there for adults, and I found myself laughing. And if that's the one thing I could say about this movie, Kevin James gives a decent effort. It's not that bad. Yeah, I mean, he does an okay job with what he's given. With this very bad script, he of course. makes an attempt to salvage it. All right, speaking of bad script, this movie is unfunny throughout. It tries so hard to be. And matter of fact, it comes off as very unsettling and yeah. disturbing at times. A like, lot of the parts of this movie just kind of make you stick to your stomach. Like you're like, oh my, what? <laughs> Did that just happen? Oh, uh, just nasty and it makes you feel uncomfortable. Also, the entire movie feels lazy from the way it's edited and just the actors. Yeah. Everyone um, feels like they're there to collect yeah. their paycheck. They're not there to actually try. They're just there to cha-ching. All the actors other than Kevin James just gave very mm. monotone, lazy performances. The script just seemed like they copy and pasted the first one and changed some details and then took out all the good jokes. And you know what? I really don't think we have much else to say about this movie. Mall Cop 2 is the worst movie of 2015 thus far. I, I, I would, say that with confidence. I will be very surprised if a movie, if a worse movie comes out this year. It's basically just a sloppier and less funny version of the first one with more dumb product placements even. Alright, so John, what are you going to give Mall Cop 2? <sighs> is it, this might be... The lowest one ever. I gotta give Mall Cop a little bit of credit for Kevin James giving an okay effort, so I'm gonna yeah. give it 0.5 out of 5 stars. You know what? Uh, John, I'm gonna go ahead and agree with you there. I thought that Kevin James did really try hard in this movie. Uh, for what he was given, I could see that you could see the straining in his eyes. You could it's see like, he was like, you're not paying me enough for this. Yeah. I'm trying to make it good. But it just, the movie fell apart. It was sloppy. None of the other actors cared. Um, this is just what happens when you make a movie just for the paycheck, and I'm sorry, but I'm going to give Mall Cop 2 a point four out of 5 stars. We were in a theater full of little kids, and not even they were laughing. That's how bad this movie is. You know something's wrong. So, what would you think of the review? Did you love it? Did you hate it? Let us know in the comments below. Also, you can follow us on Twitter, at Stubmasters, to see what's going on with our lives and our videos, and see stuff about the movie industry in general. And you can look as good as this guy with some Stubmasters gear at cafepress.com forward slash Stubmasters. Have an excellent day.